Hi, I'm Sigurd Nilsson, and I'm a candidate for Jones Library Trustee. I've lived in Amherst for nine years, and for the last five years have been a town meeting member. Before moving to Amherst, I worked in Washington, D.C. for over 30 years as a research economist and director at the Government Accountability Office, GAO. I was also the policy research director at the Council on Foundations, a philanthropy organization. I'm running for library trustee out of concern for the future of the Jones Library. I will focus here on three main points. First point, a secure financial future. You may have heard that the Jones Library is currently facing significant funding shortfalls, $40,000 this year and $100,000 next year. So decisions made in the next few years will be crucial. In response to these shortfalls, the current trustees have proposed increasing the draw on the Jones Library Endowment. I think this would be a mistake. It would be a short-sighted approach that would have long-term consequences. A series of large draws made against the endowment over time will lower the value of the endowment meaning the Jones would not have its endowment as a major source of future funding. Limiting draws on the endowment to ensure that funds are available in perpetuity is a better management approach. Instead, I would propose ways to economize, improve the investment strategy, and at the same time, create a campaign to grow the endowment so that it can re remain a primary source of funding for the library's future. We need to plan long term. Second point, good stewardship principles. Stewardship is defined as an ethic that embodies the responsible planning and management of resources. In recent years, the condition of the historic Jones Building has been allowed to deteriorate. For example, the front entrance has been neglected with peeling lead-based paint around the doorway and the finish on the door threshold has worn down to bare wood, providing no protection from the elements. This kind of neglect and lack of basic maintenance cannot be ignored any longer. Good stewardship also includes things as simple as cleaning and better organizing the interior of the library. The Jones Library is a town gem. It deserves better care. Another issue is energy efficiency. In the fall, the Jones arranged for a free energy audit funded through the state's Mass Saves program. The library is to be commended for using subsidized funds for the, from this program to update insulation, making the building more comfortable and energy efficient. However, homeowners have used this state program since at least 2011. There's something amiss that it took over six years for the library to make use of this energy saving program. Similarly, it's been nearly 28 years since the Americans with Disabilities Act, ADA, was passed. Yet, our North Amherst Branch Library still does not have an accessible public restroom. There is something seriously amiss here, too. Last fall, citizens brought forward a petition to town meeting to work toward a design for a public restroom at the North Amherst Branch Library. These citizens are to be commended for their efforts. As trustee, I would be committed to carrying that plan forward. Third point, the need to include branch libraries in all future library planning. In the proposed multi-million dollar demolition expansion plan for the Jones Library, I was struck by the lack of reference to our branch libraries. Amherst has a three building library system that provides valuable services to our community. Our library's planning needs to reflect this value. In conclusion, as library trustee, I would focus on a secure financial future, good stewardship principles, and system-wide planning for our Jones Library. I'm Sigurd Nelson, and I would appreciate your vote for Jones Library trustee. Thank you.